New at 4 o'clock, a wild robbery in South Philadelphia as two suspects carried out a $100,000 heist. Detectives say the men followed their victims out of a check cashing business and then crashed into their vehicle. It's Tuesday afternoon. I'm Shari Williams. And I'm Brian Taft. The big story on Action News today is that armed robbery that seems to have been carefully planned and executed this morning. Police are right now still looking for the bandits. Action News reporter Katie Catro live now on the scene on the 2800 block of South Randolph Street street with the full story. Katie. Brian and Shari, neighbors are left in shock to find out that an armed robbery happened right here in broad daylight and that man tells police a hundred thousand dollars in cash was stolen from him. It's hard to believe but it's the truth. I swear it's looked like an action movie. Action movie. Boom. Hit the other van from the back. Hit my car. See the gun. Neighbors in South Philadelphia can't believe their quiet street on the 2800 block of Randolph was the scene of an armed robbery. Pretty, pretty crazy situation. At the top of Randolph Street is Whitman check cashing, where police say a 44 year old man cashed a check for $100,000 around 930 this morning. He put the cash in his work van, but barely made it down the street. But it was a pretty loud screech. Witnesses say the alleged robber was trailing the man here down Randolph Street when he T-boned him right at this intersection of Bigler Street and then pushed that man's van into this woman's car. I saw two guys came in out from the car with a gun. Police say the two men held up a gun to the victim in the van, grabbed his money and took off in a white van. He was pretty shaken up. And sources also tell us that those two men may have taken the victim's cell phone as well. If you know anything about this, police are asking that you contact them. Reporting live in South Philadelphia, Katie Catro, Channel 6, Action News. Brian and Shari, 